hi guys lens here and in this video i'm gonna show you how we can fix your nokia lumina phone and that is if the system for the phone is crash and if the phone is not turning on and it is not showing any form of life but when you detect it via the computer it is detecting and it is still not lighting up or anything in this case what happened with my phone is that the windows device recovery tool messed up my phone i hook it up and the installation failed for some reason and the phone was brick okay guys lens here and i'm gonna show you exactly what you need to do this is the software that you will need to perform this recovery windows phone internals I'm gonna show you the step that you need to take step by step, right? But before I begin, this is the software that actually damaged my phone system, right? And I don't wanna make it sound this way, but it actually did. And I also tried the emergency recovery method as well, which failed okay so this is what i'm saying the internet connection is not connected at the moment but this is the software this is the software that i'm talking about here okay so what i'm saying guys is that this is the software that i recover my phone with and you will need a few files i'm gonna show you what you will need and I'll put everything in the video description you will need the hex file for your version phone and I have my hex file here in my downloads and you will also need your ROM file my file is RM915 and you can find this number at the back of your phone underneath of your battery so you will need to download this i'll also list a link where you can go and download this as well you also need the sbl file some might say that this is not necessary but it is it actually helped me recover my phone so you will need the sbl file as well for your phone and i will link the link in the description where you can download it so let me go ahead and show you the step in what in let me go ahead and show you the steps in which I take to recover my phone right first you need to unlock bootloader and that is if your bootloader is locked but you need to go through this step in recovering your bootloader if your phone is brick unresponsive not coming on not lighting up so we need to go here right i am going to go ahead and plug up my phone for this operation so we need to plug up my phone whatever driver is coming up with this it will actually detect your phone even if it is a completely different driver that is showing there and it, it is not saying windows or it's not saying nokia it will detect so i just plugged in my phone i'm waiting for the connection here and here you can see there you can see that my there you can see that my phone is connected sometimes the software will just close like that i think that this is an issue and what you need to do just reopen the software and try again and maybe it will not do this for you but probably it's because of my computer system I'm not too sure if this version is compatible but this is not the latest version as the latest version 
it's not working on my computer so I'm using an earlier version so my phone is now detected and you can see the information here of my phone right so you need to go to this step as well so what you will need to do you will need to unlock your bootloader and you will just need to enter your firmware file and and when you enter your firmware file that would just that would just redo your bootloader unlock your bootloader if your phone is AT&T Verizon or Fudu or T-Mobile your phone will just restart and it will be in this mode you will see a big Nokia screen there so you'll be in a mode where it's in the bootloader mode and it is in sync with the software as well a big Nokia screen there so you'll be in a mode where it's in the bootloader mode and it is in sync with the software as well so if you want to go ahead now and you want to flash your phone you go to platform you go to flash device right here so we go to flash and you will need the different files that I talked about before so we are not gonna install a custom ROM we're gonna flash this with the original flash files right so you will need to get your original file which is on my desktop you will need to select the largest file which is the FFU file which is right here you open that and then you will also need to you will also need to enter the other files as well right so you will see that option there to enter the SBL file and also the hex file which is in my downloads so you will need the hex files which is this right here for your phone and you will need the SBL file along with your ROM file so guys that's what you will need you will see the different options right here as my phone already fixed before so you will not see that option so you will need to enter those three files and then you hit flash it will take about 10 minutes or so approximately 10 to 15 minutes and it will flash your phone and your phone will be back as brand new running faster than ever and because it is a stock file you will also need to do an update and after you update it it will update to the latest windows version so guys this is what i'm talking about here right now once you enter those three files the hex file and the other file that i mentioned and your firmware that file is sbl file once you enter these files your phone will flash successfully and you will able to revive your device i know that this video will be helpful to some of you because you know i was looking for a solution on how to revive my phone and due to that i came across this method and I'm putting this video out there because I know a lot of persons are asking all over the internet on different forums on how they can fix this issue where their device is brick. Okay guys, so the software that did the damage to my phone is this software and it's opening it should not do that uh, the installation failed and after I just messed up my phone I even tried uh, this method in doing the emergency recovery and it didn't work and I actually 
try updating my phone through the software after doing it over in the windows internals software i actually did it over in that and then after try doing it in this and it did the same thing again so i'm just putting this one out there and for those of you who are looking to solve this issue i hope that this video was helpful and you can subscribe to my channel and also hit the like button if you find it not useful also hit the dislike button let me know enjoy i'm lens